Now that you've recorded your content, the process of assembling those video clips into a finished video is editing, which will include importing video clips and files, splitting and trimming video clips, video transitions, adding titles and text to your video, audio, and export settings. In this tutorial, we will be using Adobe Premiere Rush. Adobe Premiere Rush is a free video editing application for Mac, PC, and mobile devices. You can download a free copy at adobe.com. We will start by importing our video footage, which is the process of showing the editing software where the video clips reside. Let's see an example. First, we want to open up Adobe Premiere Rush. We want to create a project. We want to name our project. This one will be called Adobe Premiere Rush Editing Basics. Take a look on the left hand side. Over here are all your drives and files. Select your media. Click Create. Notice over here down to the left, you have a cut tool, a duplicate tool, an expand tool. We'll touch bases on these later. Now that you have a basic understanding of importing video and files, you may want to split or trim these video clips to remove unwanted pauses or sections in your video. Let's see how this is done. To cut, split, or trim a video clip, move your playhead to the location on the video clip. Click the scissors on the left hand side that will cut or split the video clip. Select the unwanted portion of the video and click the trash can. Now that you got all your video clips trimmed, let's go over transitioning from one clip to the next. Transitions are like the glue between video clips. By helping us move smoothly from one clip to the next, we can give our video a polished look. Let's add some transitions. On the right hand side, Click the transition button. Click the video clip you want to add a transition to and select a transition preset. You'll notice the transition is added to the beginning and the end of the video clip. If you do not want this, go to the beginning or the end of the clip, select the transition and delete it. So far, we've trimmed out our mistakes and we're transitioning smoothly between clips. And adding text is a great way to inform our audience about what is to come. Let's explore how text can be added to our videos. On the right hand side towards the top, the T is for the text. Select the T and choose a template. There are all kinds of text, such as title pages, lower thirds, even subscribe buttons for you YouTubers. Click and drag the selection to the timeline. Double click the text to edit the words. You in the game now. 50% of your video is audio. So having good audio is paramount. Let's look at how we can adjust the audio. To edit audio, first select the audio clips you want to affect. Next, go to the right side towards the top you'll see an audio button right here. Click to access the controls. Here we have basic, where we can adjust the audio clip volume. If you select several clips, you can adjust the volume of all the clips together. In the advanced tab, you'll notice different areas that will select the voice or the type of audio. Select the type of audio based on the audio you are adjusting. We now have completed our video. 
Now it's time to export that video into a movie file. To export the video, click on the share tab. Name your video. Confirm where you're saving it to. Nothing's worse than saving a file or video and not knowing where you saved it. For this basic tutorial, I like to leave advanced settings as is. Now click export. Done data. That concludes our tutorial for Adobe Premiere Rush. If you have any questions or run into any problems, 